Are you starting it, Ross? Hey, we're good. <laughs> we're good. <laughs> we're not planning shit today, I tell you that. I don't even know today's date. Today is July 20th. Yeah, welcome to this. Are we going to go? Welcome to the 10.30... Yeah, welcome to the 10.30 a.m. edition of the Born Stupid Show. And it is now 11. Yeah, right. Just like normal. <laughs> Shit started late. We're two weeks late. John picks the start time, and he shows up five minutes late. Actually, I think it was seven minutes late. We're Does that this. mean we're pregnant if we're two weeks late? I guess. Yeah. <laughs> we got a born stupid baby on the way. <laughs> John, well, I guess we, we both are because John's fucking us with his tardiness. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, Ross, is, I what found out started? Ross was in a bad mood this morning. No, I'm in a good mood today. No, you've been bitter since I've been here. No, good. I'm, I'm a stickler for time. <laughs> <laughs> I think we go over this every week. <laughs> oh man! Yeah, because before before you got on, Micah, we we're talking about uh, the days we do it, and uh, somehow I don't even know how we I don't even know how we got on it. Hmm. And John was like, "Well, you know, we don't, we really don't do it on Thursdays anymore." I'm like, "Well, <laughs> we haven't." <been. laughs> He was like, we can move it to Wednesdays. So I'm like, well, if we move it to Wednesdays, we're doing it early rather than 9.30 at night like we usually do on a Thursday. He was like, well, we can move it to Saturday. I was like, well, if we move it to Saturday, I can guarantee half the time we won't do it on Saturday because we'll have other stuff going on. He was like, well, yeah, if that's the case, we can do it on Wednesday or a Tuesday. I'm like, John, you know, I'm a stickler for uh, time and a schedule. I need to set time to do everything. But if we move it to Wednesday at 6 o'clock, it's still hot. <laughs> I don't know what we're gonna do. I know. I'm just, just pretty much gotta shit. figure out when you want to do it. <laughs> and John was like, "Yeah, then I signed up for my MMA class. I could do it any day of the week I want." And I was like, "So you picked the one day we did the podcast?" <laughs> well, no, I can't do I can't do that class any day. Those Uh-oh. classes are Tuesdays and Thursdays. There's just unlimited classes throughout gotcha. the week. It's just the classes I want are Tuesdays and Thursdays. Real nice, John. See, yeah. Well, we weren't doing I'm on the one th- that always, we weren't doing on Thursdays anyways. Egg and it's all my fault. I'm the one that throws the the, the monkey sucker. wrench into the equation. Like <laughs> my schedule's all over the place. See, LTI is trying to be nice and compensate and address my needs, but I don't know what my needs are because I don't know what my schedule is. <laughs> so, well, well, we'll get to the real reason why you're up in Michigan here shortly. But and, and I found oh, out I'd why love, you're there. And we're complaining about me signing up for Tuesdays and Thursdays, <laughs> but Ross wasn't showing up to the gyms anyway. So oh, it's like I got something. I got to do something. That doesn't, that doesn't affect the podcast do something. at all. We weren't doing the podcast <laughs> on Thursdays, and you're not showing up to the gym. <laughs> so I got to find something to do. I got to have a reason to train. I'm I train hard as fuck every day. I'm done with the gym. Got to switch yeah. it up. Yeah, you're, why are you done I with can't. the gym? Because it's boring, and I'm still fat. <laughs> I don't work so on what I need to work on whenever I go to the gym with you. You know why he's not going anymore? He's saying that he's we're a quitter. He's saying that we're boring, John. He don't enjoy our, uh, me and you's company. Like, no, I'll go, back, I'll go back to the gym. I'll go back to the gym when you come back, Micah. John's was, boring. Yeah, I was gonna say he just doesn't want to go to the gym with me because he doesn't want to go with me. When you come back, he'll probably come back again. When Mike is there, I know he'll be there on time. Actually, he'll be there early. <laughs> when John's there, I gotta wait uh, till six oh three before he pulls up. Well, then show up at six oh three. No, because we work out at 6 o'clock. <laughs> if we uh, start showing up at 6.03, John will start showing up at 6.10 because yeah. he knows he's got a few, yeah. few more minutes of buffer. No. John doesn't know that Mike is already there at like 5.35. No, Mike had told me. <laughs> but I, I, most I of the time, do. I have to wait for Danielle to get home. Cause oh, yeah, because I, first... Snap, I see her Snapchats at 5.40 of her in the kitchen and uh, Tori eating a banana sideways – or not a banana, uh, yeah. pickle sideways at 5.40. <laughs> it's true. Because At 540. Get, okay. <laughs> okay. Have a kid and tell me tell me how hard it is to get out of the house. Breaking news, John. You're late to the gym every day when you didn't have a kid. <laughs> it's even harder now. <laughs> it's even harder. <laughs> Back then, I was playing video games till the last second. Now I got a kid. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Responsibilities have changed, but the time has up. Nothing's changed. Ross still hates my guts. 
<laughs> I fuck. I, 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 God damn it, I hate you. I, that's how I feel lately. But God damn, I respect you. <laughs> what was that old school? Man, I yes. fucking hate that's you. Right. But God damn it, I respect you. He doesn't hate me enough to <laughs> still. He doesn't hate me enough not to still hang out. Though. I like to drink beer. <laughs> hey, we have mutual friends. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Well, regardless of your your opinion on me, I still love you, man. Oh, no that's homo. gay. <laughs> I said no homo. So yeah, it's been about uh, two weeks since we had a podcast, and two weeks since we seen each other. It's been about all. two weeks since Ross's blood pressure been this high. <laughs> so what what has gone on? Yeah. What's gone on within the two weeks? Uh, we had Fourth of July. We had Fourth of July. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I went to Tiger Town, watched fireworks. I didn't, I didn't do anything for that four day weekend. Yep. Was I was cool. on an airplane on the 4th of July, flying back to parts unknown. Michigan. <laughs> Didn't we go to a party yeah, at John's? No. Maybe. Uh, no, it was just we drank beer by the pool for two or three hours on, yeah, a, it wasn't on Saturday. A real, it wasn't a real party, but it, I mean, it was just hanging out. I was home and before the sun went down. <laughs> I signed up for BJJ classes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, That's been Twice fun. a week, right? Twice a week, Tuesdays and Thursdays, 6.15. And I was late to one because I was signing, I was paying for my class. Oh, uh, sure. I was still there on time. We went to that new bar place. Oh, uh, Brulands. Bru- Brulands. Brulands. <laughs> Brulands. It's in the same complex Brulands. as uh, Keister's and Johnny G's. It's where in the corner where uh, Lifestyles used to be. Linksters. Oh yeah. Did they you say Keister's? Keister's. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's yeah. Linksters. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's in the corner where Lifestyles Family Fitness used to be. It's really? it's actually nice. It's an it's adult. Re- yeah, it's, it's nice. an adult arcade. They oh, have nice. adult arcade. They have a crap load of pool tables. They have a crap load of dart boards. They have a nice a bar. bar. There's no smoke kinda in like there. Kind of like a Dave and Buster's. Pretty. It's a it's a Polk County Dave and Buster's for sure. <laughs> the fucking cheese fries were banging. Yeah. Fucking overload bacon. Mm-hmm. Like oh, it was so and it's good. brand new, so it's still nice. And then people nice. – the, and they keep the riffraff out. Yeah, riffraff. <laughs> that's what that, one guy came over. He's like, they keep the riffraff out of here. It's nice in here. And it's, sure enough, uh, John John and Claire and Mickey went up there the next night because they went up there with us that night. The next night they, they went up there. They sent a video of the they cops sent escorting snap, people out. Uh, the cop, uh, yeah, the security escorting uh, some people about to start fighting in there. They just escorted them out. <laughs> the riffraff. The riffraff. The riff-raff. There's a lot of riffraff in Polk County, though. Yep. But oh, it was funny, is, though. Man. People were in there just – I don't know what they were doing, but they were about to fight or whatever, and they just drag them out. Go over to Johnny G's. Get the hell out of here. Yeah, go back <laughs> over there. Or go to Keister's. <laughs> Keister's, yeah. <laughs> That's a nice establishment in here, man. Uh, what no else fighting in here. But it is like – it's like a pool hall. It's pretty nice. With an arcade. Well, yeah. Off to the side. It has about 20 games, 20, 30 games in it. Danielle is badass at the Jurassic Park. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I had to put in. I suck at the basketball. All right, so you know when you die in arcade when you're playing with somebody, it's like put in a coin to continue so you can keep playing with your friend. I had to yep. reload like four times, <laughs> and she didn't reload at all. <laughs> I'm like, well, how did you learn how to play this shit? Like, it was fucking crazy. Spent a lot of time at the arcade. Well, if there's fucking dinosaurs making a comeback, I'm bringing her. Oh, That's speaking right. of Fourth of July. This fucking trailer park next to my subdivision yeah. must have had leftover fucking fireworks. They were setting them <laughs> bitches off last night at 9 o'clock in the, at night. Boom! Like the mortar ones. I'm like, yeah. Jesus Christ. It sounds like uh, fucking Baghdad over here. I seen a badass video where they t- uh, tied mortars to a drone. And oh, they're <laughs> shooting them at people. I saw that. <laughs> it looked badass. The video looks badass of it firing at people. Yeah. They were shooting them at their neighbors because they were having a party and they were too loud and they wouldn't be quiet. So that is awesome. So they took the drone up there and started shooting them at them, man. Yeah. yeah. That would be fun as fuck. They have a drone war and you everybody oh, has okay. their own drone. Drone. You're firing at the people that are controlling the other drones or you're trying to fire it at the That sounds drone. like they could be very expensive by the end of it. A lot of shot down $600, $700 drones. All right. So when we make it, <laughs> when yeah. the Born Stupid Show when is big happens. enough to buy our own drones so we can have fucking Roman Candle Wars. I'm buying a military-grade one. <laughs> That's when you know you've made it. Well, you fucking got the fucking big ass. Yeah, I got the one that you see flying over Afghanistan and shit. <laughs> yeah. Let's just go all out and do it with helicopters. Fuck yeah. That would be probably a little harder to control, though. I don't care. Right? We can use heat-seeking missiles instead of uh, them little pussy things you're talking about. I'll just put a Patriot missile in my front yard. I can shoot that bitch straight from the ground. <laughs> Patriot missile. You would uh, use a Patriot missile. Hell yeah. 
What else? Yeah, you wouldn't use any other time. I'm going to do chemical warfare. I'm dropping oh. anthrax on y'all. I, I, I'm i now a B class in iRacing now, Micah. That happened within the last two weeks. What I race, really? I race the in, in fix, so, Xfinity Series. So and my rating took a shit. Because <laughs> you wrecked? <laughs> no, oh, fuck, man. It's pissing me off. Uh, Daytona week. My whole, uh, I said, I am not going to race at Daytona because I don't want it to, my rating to take a shit. Against my better judgment, <laughs> I raced at Daytona with two laps to go. I'm in third place, fucking on the bottom line, holding, waiting to make my move on the last lap. The one time someone bump draft me, it made me face the field against the wall. Nice. I lost wall like up. 30 fucking safety points that, that week. All because I went against my better judgment. Actually, there's a pitch. There, there. There's my car on the on the screen. Yep, it didn't make it to the race I, though. <laughs> nope. Now you, now you know how the real life drivers feel like. You it, race that whole race and then you get crashed. Last week at Kentucky, sucks. first lap, I qualified ninth. Coming out of turn two, someone in the second row got sideways and took out the entire field. I lost a nice. shitload of points there. <laughs> uh, what else happened? Stranger Things season three was Never released. Watched it. Never oh, watched it's it. my favorite show. You got It's my new favorite show. It's better than Game of Thrones. Well, no, it's my new. It's my favorite show that's running right now. Game of Thrones would be a by all time. Favorite Is it better show. than Deadwood? Because I've only seen one episode of Deadwood, and part they're, of it. They're different shows, but I always held out on Stranger Things. Uh, it's one of those things. You know when your mother recommends. You watch a show, yeah, your instinct is, I'm not going to watch this show because it's probably going to fucking suck. So for the last two years, my mom was saying I had to watch it. And then July 4th, Netflix released season three, and 98% of my Facebook was commenting on it. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to watch it. I'm going I'm to watch it. I binged watch three seasons in three days. <laughs> it is my new favorite show on TV. So are you admitting you probably should follow your mom on Facebook? I don't want to go that far. <laughs> <laughs> Your mom's not always wrong, Ross. You can admit it. No, well, Mike. Well, Mike uh, had that test um, a few months ago. I think what it was test? the Mother's Day one. Uh, the test uh, oh, yeah, proving the that your mom's a fucking liar. liar. <laughs> yeah. It turns out my mom was within that two percent of not being a fucking liar. <laughs> well, it might she still might be? It just depends on the topic. Ninety-eight percent of the time, yeah. she's a fucking liar yeah. every time. <laughs> <laughs> Mom would tell you some bullshit. All right, listen to this. I remember vividly my mom trying to convince me to go to the beach. And I'm like, Mom, it's going to fucking storm all week. I've been watching the fucking news. <laughs> like, it's, We're going to be sitting in that room 15 deep, and it's only like a one-room, a one-bedroom Like when thing. me and Micah met you in Studio, New Smyrna. Yeah. And she want, yeah, it's, we're going to New Smyrna. And she wants to cram in like 20 people. I'm like, I'm not going. I'm going to go hang out with Dad. And she's like, you're going. And I'm like. I am not sitting in this room. You're crazy. <laughs> She's like, it's not going to storm. You went, it's, didn't you? I had to. <laughs> it stormed the whole fucking time. We're just all crammed in there. Was there a baby screaming in the room, too? Uh, how <laughs> I old, don't remember. It was, how old were you when this happened, John? I was in my teens. Oh, so you had to all go. Right. I, was over, <laughs> I, was like, I was over the bullshit. I, I was, was like, smart John enough to know. You're watching the news at what age? Like, I think it was probably 15 because I wasn't able to drive away at that point. <laughs> Uh, you were com you were sucked in, yeah. Yeah, no I was fourteen, fifteen ish. Like I'm not allowed just to freaking leave. I was like, hell no, I'm not going. You're going. Okay. I'm going. Have you even looked at the weather? <laughs> have, have, you have, even, you, have you even looked at this? Have you listened to Paul Delgado? <laughs> <laughs> I want to say. Oh, back then was Steve Jervy before he blew his head off. <laughs> <laughs> Steve Jervy's still around. It was something winners. What? Oh, John dumb. Winner. Yeah, that's what it was. <laughs> oh, uh, somebody jumped off. Um, they committed suicide off Lakeland Regional just recently. That's cool. Yeah, they. Oh. Yeah, there's, I saw some uh, pictures online. Huh. That's strange. They would release pictures. Well, I think somebody saw it and oh. put it on there. I don't think it was like it wasn't news media or nothing. But they already had like a a thing over them. But oh, wow. I think it, I think something happened where I don't know. But it was crazy. Anyways. That was <laughs> I derailed it pretty quick. Yeah, what are you fucking? Oh, so, speaking man. of death, um, a guy got bit by a snake. I don't remember what country it was in, but it's not here. He was like sixty something years old, and he got bit by a snake, and then he ended up biting it and killing it, and they both died. 
<laughs> Dunn says, fuck you, Snake. More than me <laughs> yeah. biting you back. Like, oh, you bit me? I'm going to bite you. I'm going to bite you. Yep. <laughs> fuck you, Snake. But he was claiming he already caught this? poisonous snakes earlier in the day. And because they like basically are unloading trucks and huh. um, snakes. You know how it is. Undoing uh, bales of hay and grain. That's and not how anti venom works, though. <laughs> yeah, Let's take did. a bite out of the old snake. Is this guy's name Jungle? <laughs> snake uh, Snake. Let me see if I can. Let me see if I can pull up uh, what it was. The sneaky like, snake. Like fuck you, snake. I'm gonna eat your ass with some man eyes. <laughs> if I had to guess, it probably happened somewhere like in India or Indonesia, somewhere over there in the. Um, it's goo Alabama. Zimbabwe. Goo, Alabama. Goo jar rats. Goo jar, I have never heard goo, of goo jar, goo jar rats. rats. Mustagar district. Madagascar? <laughs> I'm not good with uh, pronouncing <laughs> foreign. Other, I'm not good with other names. Here it is, Ross. Can you try it? Uh, DT. In the Goo, <laughs> goo rats Mahigar district. The district of where? That sounds like it that area it's between not your clear, asshole man. and your nutsack. It's not somewhere where we're from. Well, it's somewhere where they use kilometers. Afternoon in the A Ajawan dish village in Santurpa Tissel. Yeah, this doesn't actually say the country, though. That country sounds like that area that's between the back of your nutsack and your asshole. <laughs> Taint? <laughs> The Gooch. The Gooch. Whatever it is. Yeah, the Gooch. Oh, what people do not know is uh, Micah is, his secret location this week is off of a random road underneath an oak tree in hiding. Yeah, in hiding. Which? It's, uh, it's going to be a scorcher here today. Like, it's a, it's a whopping 82 right now. But Molly Whopper? Get up to 97. <laughs> Yeah, you know, Molly when, Whopper. When you're just sitting in a random spot in a tree, you will the cops do ride up on people just yeah. sitting there because they're trying to check out what's going on. This guy must be smoking his methamphetamine. Yeah, <laughs> you might get searched. Hopefully they'll arrest me and extradite me back to Florida, free hey, trip. Well, before before you switch it, since I've had my driver's license photo updated, I have cops following me. I've never been trailed so many times I within a week. Yeah, because if you look at my photo, my that hair is That happened within down. the last two weeks? You yes. got a new license? <laughs> I got a new license on July 8th. Since then, I've had at least five or six cops follow me for over a mile waiting for me to do something to pull me over. <laughs> Before, because I was clean cut. My photo looked like just – it was probably like this. Say, just leave him alone. You, you look like a – you look like a jihadist now. <laughs> yeah, I that. They profile like a motherfucker, though. For now, why? They you say they your, don't, but they do. You got to take your fucking shoes off before you come into my house. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what the fuck is in those things. <laughs> don't blow my house up. <laughs> you guys do not need to stereotype. That but is not nice. Micah needs to watch out. Job. You were saying how the cops will see a random person parked off the side of the road yeah. and might want to search them? Well, they're in high alert up there in Michigan, which like I told Micah, I know the reason why he's up there now. Why? Uh, let's hear it. There's a serial pooper on the loose up in Michigan. Serial <laughs> pooper. <laughs> and he has shit on houses before. Yeah. You, you're up to something, huh? Yeah. Damn. There is a serial pooper on Pri the loose up in Michigan. <laughs> Private I. Ross. Which is, uh, cause, there's, the person is going around so much, it is causing carnivals to be canceled. <laughs> wow. Oh, Does this guy, like, Fucking chug Miralax and Dokalax and try to just shit on everything and just can keep consuming food or what? I don't know, but they released a statement on July 12th, uh, the Seriously? board president saying, regarding the recent pool closures, someone oh, has been – yeah, I guess there's pools at the carnival. It says carnival in the, uh, in the title, but it says pools in the article. Someone has been defecating in the pools due to the frequent uh, – their frequency over the past week. We believe this is intentional. At the present time, we're reviewing or they're reviewing attendance logs, and re, uh, they record a video. So, uh, I guess they're draining the pools, cleaning pools, because some dudes walking. We're gonna see cameras all over pools and hot tubs now. <laughs> Micah, Micah walking around covering his face, wearing a born stupid hat and a Micah Williams <laughs> racing T-shirt. <laughs> They'll never catch me. Free sponsorship. Never. I gotta cover my face. <laughs> <laughs> or free publicity. Yeah. I'm like, good God. Don't go to they jail for me. that. Don't go to jail for that. <laughs> the, the oh, there's a Jeep, behind, there's a Jeep yeah. pulling uh -oh, up behind you. Uh-oh. What's going on? 
<laughs> is he over here wanking it? <laughs> that was so getting out. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Can you zoom in? Can you zoom in for us? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? We might have another live interview. Uh oh. <laughs> Brought to you by Micah. Oh man, it'll be That's perfect right. if a cop rolled up on you when you talk to a cop. <laughs> like, dude, I'm just doing oh, a podcast oh. and be like <laughs> I'd let it I'd let it roll that way I can Hell yeah. get my ass uh, nice thing. <laughs> Hell yeah. Let it ride. We can talk to him, see if we can get him to laugh. Tell him Actually, some, tell guys, him some cop is, jokes. We got fans. We got fans rolling up. Fans. Oh, they, they, they're on to you. They know you're undisclosed location now, so you got a fucking fan base up there. Either that or this has been that detective that's been following me around to try to catch me pooping in a pool. <laughs> <laughs> that means, well, and Ross just spilled the beans. We Ross has been wired. He's been tapped. Oh, oh fuck. <laughs> oh, shit. I did see something online, and it was like, in the 80s and 90s, uh, you have to be worried about being wiretapped and stuff. And now we're like, Alexa, play this. And they're recording yeah. everything that you have. Everything. <laughs> it's like they probably even use your cell phone against you. Oh, shit, here comes the cop, too. I ain't kidding. Look. <laughs> oh, he's turning the oh, other way. the other way. <laughs> uh, that would have been so funny. That guy doesn't look like a oh, pooper. <laughs> he's not the serial the pooper. Was com- he was coming up fast, too. Like, like I was starting to get... Worried you know, <laughs> me in for something I didn't do. Well, you're not drinking, right? You're not. You're not drinking, are you? No, I ain't, I ain't been drinking. Have you had your Culver's? Are yet you today? on a, Are you on private property? <laughs> uh, there's no sign that says you can't be here. All right, then. Well, I think you're good. <laughs> it's God's country. <laughs> That's God's what country. I tell them. Blake Shelton said. So. <laughs> That's where I was going with it. <laughs> Let the, tell the cop they can name the babies. You will name the dogs. <laughs> 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 is that a different song? Oh, Red's a damn yeah. dog. That's a different song, too. <laughs> she can name the babies and I'll name the dogs. <laughs> but, Micah, the, you can probably line up Blake Shelton's songs, and if Micah got arrested, Old, Red gets, him, old Red gets him out. <laughs> he hooks up a lady. You name the babies, you name the dogs. It's God's country where it started. P.S. This is Austin. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you keep going. This is Austin. <laughs> Oh man, it's uh, Blake Shelton's the soundtrack to Mike's life. <laughs> yeah. I chewed it back, chewed it back, chewed it back. <laughs> yeah, you don't do that. Your teeth are too pretty. You know how That's, uh, uh, spider you're... thing y'all came across all day. <laughs> <laughs> That's just nasty. <laughs> we, when Ross first started, it was zoom. Full down, face, honest. Micah. Full face. You could see his teeth. I was like, dude, I don't know what's whiter, your teeth or your eyes. <laughs> you know how maybe uh, my lies. My lies have been pretty white here lately. <laughs> white, white lies. <laughs> white Michael, white lies. <laughs> um, you know how every week, we're, well, haven't lately, at least within the last two weeks, yeah. uh, bitched about the wait time for the pizza? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, apparently, uh, the lady's long wait time for a pizza led to her winning the fucking lottery jackpot. Really? Yep. <laughs> How'd that happen? She they ordered give pizza. Her a free t- lottery ticket with her pizza? Nah, she, uh... She fucking ordered a pizza and said it was going to be forever, so she went out and got a lottery ticket and won $1.5 million. Wow. Man. Why can't I have some luck like that? I know. Well, I got to fucking play the lotto to win the lotto. That's my problem. We've been That's doing true. some scratch-offs lately. Like $5 scratch-offs. Yeah, I've seen Tori. I've seen Tori won like 116 bucks. <laughs> I doubt she's getting that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Going to her college fund. According to the Snapchat. Uh, Snapchat Daniel sent this morning, Tori won. Really? I haven't seen the Snapchats yet. Yeah, it said somebody y'all played your Chinese numbers, the lucky numbers, and won 116 bucks. Yeah. Hmm. Well, that's cool. This morning I got my checking account right now. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Y'all see the new fad right now? What's that? Uh, one. The face he- app? Heavy metal fit or heavy metal knitting? <laughs> No, I have not seen yes. that. Yeah. I have not seen that. <laughs> Apparently, like, in Russia, Finland, like, in Europe and all that, uh, there's a thing going around where, like, these heavy metal bands will be playing, and people will be on fucking stage knitting to the fucking music. <laughs> that's pretty entertaining. <laughs> the videos are funny as shit. And it's not like old ladies. It's people yeah. like, look like you fucking just bobbing head their head, their hair going in. everywhere, <laughs> just fucking knitting the shit out of blankets Fuck and yeah, stuff. And I'm like, good yeah, God. Kill that <laughs> yeah. If I did that. My knit would just be like a big yarn ball. I, was I wouldn't even actually make anything. Knit this motherfucker, knit this motherfucker, knit, yeah. 
yeah, this yeah, is yeah. Uh, in heavy metal knitting. You like I'm stirring up a pot bowl of spaghetti. <laughs> Just a flick of the wrist. Just <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that might be like competitive knitting. Can you, <laughs> that might be fun. <laughs> But it said in heavy metal knitting, the knitter becomes part of the band, showing their best needlework tricks as a heavy as the heavy riffs echo in the background. <laughs> so your Whoa. guitar hero in the past could pay off. Yeah. <laughs> well, we got cop just trolling you now. Uh oh. Up oh, no, that's a that's a gangster. Uh, Hearst. That's a gangster <laughs> wagon. Are you near the fucking uh, funeral home? No, I'm right next to Walgreens. Oh, no. <laughs> Some characters rolling around. In a Rite I'm in between a Walgreens and a Rite Aid. I haven't seen a what 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 the fuck's a Rite Aid? It's Same a thing is like a ex Walgreens. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, why would they but have from like the seventies? Why would they have them stacked on top of each other? Was well, it how it is Both. here in Lakeland? You have the CVS and the Walgreens uh half a block away from each other. Yeah. Boom, damn. Same thing. It's a monopoly, man. Well, it's not a monopoly because there is competitors right across the street. If it was a monopoly, it'd be just one one company just running it and no one else has a chance. Well, that one asshole bought a, a property next to you and they put three hotels on it. Yep. Dicks. <laughs> dicks. <laughs> Fuck those dicks. <laughs> Actually, right now, that's the top of the list of the name of this episode. Dicks. dicks. Dot, dot, dot. <laughs> but speaking uh, of drugstores... Uh, since Mike has said that, you hear what's happening in Colorado right now? No. Police dogs, or not police dogs, dogs in general, are getting high in Colorado. They're eating all the people's weed. They're eating poop and stuff. Dogs eating poop. Oh. Yeah. That's the what? Thing, that's the thing that dogs do. If you ever, like, if you have a cat, if you have other animals. That's true. If dogs, yeah. see, oh, poop, yeah. if dogs see poop or vomit, they have to eat it. Well, apparently. They in, don't uh, have to eat it. No, it's. Some <laughs> don't, some do. No joke. Like, in my house. Breaking news, I got cats and dogs. If my my dogs could be in a deep sleep and if if they hear a cat in the background like starting to puke, them fucking dogs. Oh, I, I don't have to well, clean yeah. it up. The dogs p- pick it up for me. They pick up the fancy feast that fucking big owl still yaks wipe, all over the still fucking wipe floor. wipe the floor though, right? The the dog slobber, I do. Okay. Maybe sometimes. Right. It sounds good on the internet. Yeah, I can <laughs> <laughs> No. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> But yeah, I apparently dogs to. are getting high because they're eating fucking poop and shit. So that's how dogs and cats get high, is eating each yeah. other's shit. I'm so high. I guess if it puts <laughs> off certain types of gas and then, you know, you eat it. I don't know. I, I about throw up smelling that shit. I can't yeah. imagine eating it. I, I, throw, I about throw up watching my dog eat it. Oh, we, he's um, turning my, the camera again. Oh, oh more police. Oh, the police oh, presence. We got some traffic. Oh, we got a truck got coming trucks up. checking you off. They're, They're fucking circling you. Oh, you know what's funny? <laughs> they probably think that you're set up for a drug deal or something. Mm-hmm. They're probably thinking that someone's uh, going to ride up and you're going to just... Uh, trying to get that smack. Mike is getting nervous. <laughs> Mike is getting nervous. I can see it. Bro. I am nervous. <laughs> you have I'm no weapons. Sweaty. You, you might have, have to no take weapons. this show on the road. You have no beer. <laughs> yeah, you might have to drive and ride. You might have to drive and ride. I think it would be great if a cop showed up until we talked to him. But hey, bro. We're doing a podcast. I don't have any- I don't have anything on me, including my license, because I left my wallet. Oh, out. you dumb shit. You dumb shit. And I'm in, and I'm in a vehicle that's, that's not, not yours. <laughs> we, might be able to take the, we might be able to take this show to jail. Yeah, you might actually want to start riding. Keep your phone on. Just lock it whenever they uh, arrest you, and we can hear the trip to the jail and everything. Honestly, though, I think it would be so funny. But it this might may fuck, be our it, breakthrough episode. It might, it, it <laughs> might fuck your life up, though. <laughs> But for the brand, man. For the brand. For the brand, bro. <laughs> for our brand. You, you, you don't do it for all brands. That was You, you stole that quote. Mm-hmm. <laughs> if, if that's what puts us on the map and makes our show big to where we can just quit work and do this for a living, I'll do it. That's what I'll got Barstool on the map. That's I'll what got them on the map. We can do it every day. I like Barstool. Though. That's what got Barstool on the map is them stuff. being arrested outside the NFL headquarters. Really? Free Brady. Well, yep. the difference is, is Mike is just sitting in an open line. <laughs> yeah, Mike is innocent. I don't know that business. <laughs> <laughs> they just caught him without his license in a vehicle that's not his. <laughs> oh, man. In a state that he's not from. Yep, I'm not native here. I'm not from. You ain't from around here, are you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, sir. Ah, <laughs> oh, damn. Um, On a lighter note, <laughs> you know how in the past I've uh, brought up world records that would fit some of you guys? I think so. I found one that would best fit me. A man sat on the toilet for 116 hours, <laughs> setting a new world record. 
hundred without getting up. hours. Yep, one hundred sixteen consecutive hours in a local bar. I couldn't imagine That's like five days. Dude, yeah, I could not imagine fucking doing it. Even if someone's giving you food and water and everything you need, I could not imagine just sitting there for that long. Your legs go to sleep within yeah. like 30 minutes. If you're, if you're on the Dude, toilet yeah. 30 minutes, your legs are – my legs are shot. I stand up and I'm like a newborn calf. I'm not falling <laughs> over, hitting the wall. <laughs> and then you, you got the needles on the bottom of your feet. that You try to yeah. step. It's like, oh, fuck. Yeah, hell no. My butthole, my butthole would be so sore because like when you sit down on the toilet, like it automatically kind of like opens because it yeah. knows what it's supposed to be doing there. Dude, he's got to be triggered. five days of just – He's got to be doing leg lifts to keep, like, so it doesn't happen. He's got to like, be, like, throwing his legs up in the air. If I'm on the toilet longer than, like, five, eight minutes, I'll look down and my feet would be, like, fucking red and all that stuff. Like, the blood, the blood fucking just circulation gets caught off. Just imagine how your balls and your dong feel just sitting there hanging. <laughs> oh, they've never, their... they've never been more free. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but for that long? Yeah. They ain't ever been free that long. No. Freedom! They might fall right <laughs> off. Oh, uh, you might have point, some saggy you, balls because gravity was pulling on them. Oh, sorry. At that point, you would think they would start sagging and touch the water. No, they probably would. <laughs> I mean, unless you're unless you're beating off to release some of the fluids so that way they're you not that heavy. You got to do something while you're, you're in there. Gonna have, you're gonna have to do something to keep those things from being too heavy, they so said that it, way they don't fucking just. He said his goal was 165 hours, but due to the lack of sleep, he Fuck, only made 116. Damn. Oh, the fuck! Uh, is that the boat you fell out of? No. <laughs> 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 That's the sheriff boat. Holy oh, shit. shit. Oh, I didn't even fu- see it was a cop. The local police now called in the fucking sheriffs. <laughs> Jeez. You don't even need a boat where you're at right now. They got everybody they're come checking put, you out. They're going to put the boat in the pool so they can check out the turd. You should have asked them if you're going to go on a boat ride later and take, ask if you can take you fishing. No, Micah prefers mustache rides. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what was that, Super Troopers? Yeah, who wants a mustache ride? I do. Uh, so what's this baggage uh, check thing you're talking about, Micah? Well, on July 4th, I got on an airplane to come back out here to Parts Unknown. And I learned that if you don't have a checked bag, they will still check your bags. What? And what I mean, what? yeah, <laughs> what I mean by that is I went through security and once again, it said I had something implanted in my right shoulder. And this time I had something buried in my inner thigh aka my anus aka <laughs> well, no, giant side. cock sir what's that in your inner thigh, thigh. <laughs> what are you smuggling <laughs> that's my dick <laughs> yeah that's what happened old boy pulls me to the side and goes oh. uh, there's two suspicious spots here would you like me to check them here oh or, yes please and, and, uh, and, in a closed room I'm like if I'm going to be embarrassed, so Let's are you. Let's do it right here, buddy. He's like, so he's like, okay, well, whenever I get to the sensitive regions, I'm going to use the backside of my hand to check them. I'm like, well, you're going to find my fucking cop. <laughs> and uh, sure enough, <laughs> left leg, inner thigh, he starts patting around. Okay, yep, you have nothing there. <laughs> I, I tell you. Like, oh, there's something there. <laughs> oh. I'm going to bite you. Man, there's uh, nothing like getting felt up by a fucking dude. <laughs> and he probably wanted to do it, too. So you just sniff his hand I afterwards? So. Fucking I would have shake his hand. They, man, they got the fucking technology where they can fucking scan you and see That's that it's I your... Did. Yeah, the motherfuckers are on some... They're on some bullshit. But what was the bullshit part was, is when he's done, he takes my hands and says, put them put flat out like this. And then he takes this swab and he wipes both of my hands and then throws the thing in like this little machine to see if I had any residue on my hand. I'm like, yeah, it's probably called semen, you fucking guy. <laughs> We found DNA on your hands. I bet you did. <laughs> it's from here. It's from that giant I thing. I bet if you, you test down there too, you'll get the same results. It's from that python <laughs> that you just touched. <laughs> Actually, yeah. speaking about so that. Like I said, go ahead, Micah. They will fill up your bags even though you didn't check in a bag. So wow. Always be prepared. Your fun bags. I, it's not on my list, Thanks. at least. Somewhere here in Florida, they found in someone's backyard a 20-foot, 200-pound python. Holy shit. Yeah. Uh, so I don't know if anyone has that. What do you do? What, all right, what would you guys do if that was in your backyard? Light my, fire, my house on fire? 
burn the bitch down. I shit in a public pool. I, I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna go, Danielle, grab your phone. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do this. I'm gonna throw a fucking uh, whole sheet on it. Grab it by the back. It's not an alligator. <laughs> That's an alligator. You push a cover the head on an alligator, not a snake. It fucking blocks it. Fucking, they sense heat. They're, so, like, they're going to be able to pick me up. So Pythons don't attack people anyway, so you don't have to. They will if I fucking grab it. No, you won't. It would just uh, go, oh, what are you doing? Oh, guy? yeah. Leave me alone. Oh, my God. I'm going to grab your arm and choke you and they kill you. Yeah. <laughs> well, you have time to get away if it tries to coil you up. I'm going to get that bitch, though. <laughs> For born stupid, baby. Hey, Mike Rasa. is freaking out right now. <laughs> yeah. We've seen what Micah does when he cannonballs into a pool with a snake in it. No, Micah's eyes are like just back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Back and forth. That's <laughs> you got to keep your head on a swivel. I, don't I know, know, dude. I, I, I'm you know, he's stressing it right now. Like, check out these two private detectives over here. Oh, yeah. Like, walking by all nonchalant. They're dressed up in, uh, what you call it, um, uh, undercover. Undercover. Under ruse. Undercover. <laughs> Dude, these you're out of place, man. Polk County don't need to be where you're at. It so, feels like mini Polk County. You don't get judged like that here, I don't think. Not I mean, I guess I have actually. I've been fucking trailed all fucking week. Taliban. Well that's profiled. What, I've talked about it before, my passport photo. I grew yeah. out my beard to look like a fucking terrorist <laughs> just for my passport photo. My driver's license, my hair's down, my beard is probably, I don't know, what? Not full. Not full, <laughs> but how, I mean, that's a good. Spotty. Is that, what, four or five inches? Spotty. It's about five inches. About well, five inches long for that some one, parts. That one section, the middle is five inches. <laughs> the rest if you go, is If you go within thin. three quarters of an inch in each direction, it's about an inch and a half. <laughs> and my, yeah, my hair is probably down to my shoulder blades. And I had my hair down for the photo, so every time, man, I'm talking. I've never had so many cops. You should have kept like it right, right up on my right ass. now for your picture. Your your hair right now is more terroristic than leaving it down. Yeah, yeah. Well, leaving it down, yeah, but I, leaving it down looks like I'm a fucking hippie. And yeah. <laughs> this guy definitely has drugs in his pull car. Pull over, <laughs> pull him over. Like I'm like, holy. This shit, dude has man. acid in his car. Pull him <laughs> yeah, over. Pull him over. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, God, man. I'm not even doing anything. I'm just driving to fucking work, drinking my coffee. Actually, it's, it's good you brought up the drugs, though. Micah, where's this place that you would hide your drugs? Apparently, at an airport, there was a man in Spain who was traveling, trying to smuggle some drugs. And I thought this was brilliant because I'm on my way there one day. To Spain or to the airport? <laughs> no, where he would hide these drugs. His ass. He, he had... <laughs> He had a, a shit ton of cocaine underneath his toupee on his head. I did see that. What? And he made it through? No. Because <laughs> it looked like he had a shit ton of cocaine under his toupee. His toupee was like eight inches above his head. Uh, oh, I was like, holy shit, you made it, that, you made it through that? <laughs> You're not paying attention at all. Mike is over here getting felt up for having, <laughs> for having an oversized dick. Under, oh, under his... Uh... <laughs> this guy's just walking through with cocaine on his head. He just makes it through. No problem. Here's right here, John. Yeah, man. What was it, uh, Austin Powers, where he had the baby, uh, the midget arm, <laughs> yeah. holding an apple? He's like, it's like a, a right there, midget John. arm holding an apple. <laughs> <laughs> Get out of here. It's not even close. He looks like Michael Waltrip. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He's got like a sweater vest on with long sleeve, uh, pinstripe shirt. It looks like he has a fucking raccoon on his head. A raccoon, and you can clearly see a bag of cocaine on his head. <laughs> He didn't do a very good job. Wow. Yeah. They'll these never people, catch me. I guarantee you. These people are fucking. Words. These people are tards. They are fucking tards. Yeah. Yep. I just don't get it. Most people, most people doing heavy drugs like that are fucking idiots. Yep. I live uh, above the influence. We do it first place. So, uh. what got this lady arrested? This or it says, what got a man arrested? <laughs> How'd you get lady out of a man? Uh, my handwriting. I thought I put mom. It says man. A mom. <laughs> Apparently, there was a guy I had a search warrant out for him for multiple felonies. And the police were trying to find him, and he takes off running in the woods. So they've been this extensive, like, search for hours. And finally, it's dead silent in the woods, and they hear a... <laughs> the guy farted. <laughs> and, it, <laughs> and it let him 
it led them to the guy's location and they arrested the guy all because well, he farted. Dude, you can't yeah. hold some farts back too. There's something that you just cannot <laughs> hold back. You try, you try, uh, and it's got to go. Yeah, so the man's butt cheeks got him in trouble. Jeez. <laughs> He's probably got a high-protein diet. Yeah, he must, he must do jiu-jitsu and all that stuff <laughs> on the protein. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I told you, but man, my my shoulder is killing me. I about th- got that thing snapped off. <laughs> I didn't know he's gonna break my shoulder or my elbow first. Well, that's what they do in fucking MMA. So, <laughs> well, don't don't it don't tackle don't tackle a black belt. <laughs> oh, you're gonna say don't tackle a black guy. <laughs> <laughs> don't tackle a black guy. <laughs> uh, don't tackle a black uh, black belt. He fucked me up. Pretty What's quick. the lowest belt? Uh, white. I wouldn't want to tackle a white belt. <laughs> white is a beginner. White is And guess the what? Guess what? <laughs> that was funny. I almost went to the racist there. <laughs> I was like, that was what? That was funny how you cracked it. <laughs> Censorship. <laughs> <laughs> that was like Polk County all day. Yep. <laughs> but uh, I don't have I guess if you don't have a white belt, you're low so I don't have a belt at all. So, yeah, I'm the lowest, the lowest Sounds of the no low. belt. I'm a no belt. I don't even have a belt. Do you see? He's a uh, sagger. <laughs> do you see the name of the next uh, possible hurricane if they name the next storm? No. You know how they hurricane. Well, Barry. what letter are they on right now? What letter C. are they on? They're on, it's on C. C. Claritus. Uh, no, nope. Chantel. <laughs> Chantel. <laughs> <laughs> yep, Chantel. So you know uh exactly. You know what the winds are gonna sound like when them that hurricane comes blowing in? What? Instead of yeah. it's gonna be Mm-hmm <laughs> <laughs> Mm-hmm I'm gonna blow your house down now. Mm-hmm <laughs> <laughs> Where did you see that at? No, a uh, the guy at work told me he was like he was like, You see that shit? The next hurricane, the next name storm is gonna be Chantel and right off the po- top of my head it was like, You know what the wind's gonna sound like? He's like, What? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> he about died laughing. They're humming. <laughs> yeah. The wind's humming. I ain't need no man, I'm gonna blow your damn house down. Mm-hmm. <laughs> If that doesn't get us ratings, nothing will. If we don't, if our if our listens don't skyrocket this week, we're done. We're not we're not coming back next week or two mm-hmm. weeks whenever we come back. Because mm-hmm. you, <laughs> this is Chantel now. Mm-hmm. Oh, you're crazy. That'll lead us up to uh, Karen. The K Karen? is Karen. Who's Karen? You haven't seen all them memes? It's like no. why? Like the meme is like someone asking a question, and the person will answer it. With the mind your own goddamn business, Karen. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Or Karen, we're out of fucking Cheetos. Yeah. So that's what you have to look Back forward cat. to when Hurricane Karen comes along. <laughs> what if they have, like, for Jay, it's Jose? <laughs> <laughs> Jose? <laughs> Jose? <laughs> oh, man. That would be funny as hell. And then, like you said, you have the same thing. I'm going to blow your house down. <laughs> Give him a Mexican accent. He's trying, uh, trying to climb my fence. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, has there been a Jose? I don't know, probably. Unless what, it what about stuff. what about Juan? Hurricane Juan. Hurricane Juan, come through. Yeah, there's been a Juan. There's been a Juan. Hurricane a Juan. Pedro. Yeah, I think there's been a Juan. Joaquin and uh, Juan. Yeah, yeah, oh, Hurricane Joaquin. Yeah, because I remember uh, they made the hurricane path with Joaquin Phoenix's head. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's right. All right, what about Hurricane Steve? <laughs> I'm sure. Nah, they usually don't make it to the S's. I know. No, uh, last year they made it to uh, Alpha, Beta. They made it back around. Yeah. Hey, I mm-hmm. didn't realize that. There's some le- there's some letters they don't have names for, like uh, X, like them weird letters that there's not many words for. Q. Hurricane. Uh, hurricane xylophone. xylophone. Yeah. 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 <laughs> uh, so they Xerox. have that. Hurricane yeah. Wait, no, that's that's. Yeah, the... they can't trademark hurricane names. <laughs> You can make shit up, man. And you can go back Hurricane you can go Zeus. back to like the Greek times and shit. You yep. can go mix it up. Hurricane Zeus. Zeus. <laughs> that'd be badass. Zeus. That better not be a weak ass hurricane. Hurricane <laughs> Aphrodite's. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. What would you drop? A pen. Oh. Uh you have, have you had Burger King's tacos yet? I have not. Me I almost did. Yeah. I was just close. They were a dollar and I was in line. I'm like, but man, that double whopper sure does sound good. Like man, it's only a dollar to try the Burger King taco, but I didn't do it. I couldn't I was bring to say, myself to it. I was say, you didn't want diarrhea. One taco, do one. Try Fuck that! I'm getting the party pack. 
Give us a review. Because it could have been just like that, that thing, a picture we saw where they literally just took a freaking hamburger, cut it in half, stuck it in the taco shell. And I think that's fake. And cheese on it. And uh, the picture I seen on the menu, it was, looked like a real taco, like yeah. something you would get at Taco Bell. Yeah. Like it had ground beef in it. I'm trying to get in taco game. <laughs> I don't see it working out for them too well. It would probably be, is it like one of those limited time things or? Probably so. It's just probably a publicity stunt. They've seen that IHOP going to International House of Burgers got yeah. them some attention. Makes sense. I'm waiting for them to all have a, a cheeseburger pizza. Oh, man, that would be amazing. Did you see Krispy Kreme has the donut cake? It's a donut with cake-filled batter. What? Yeah, it's Where to the celebrate their anniversary. Uh, some here in Polk County? He's a famous white rapper. Krispy Kreme. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> that Monica, shit was hilarious. Oh, that shit was hilarious. <laughs> oh, man. It's not dripping out of his nose. Dude, that was yeah. funny as fuck. What was, all right, uh, we had already talked about french fries, right? No? No. Favorite, what's your favorite french fry? I'd say uh, either cur- basic curly fries, like seasoned curly fries, no, or like checker rest- fries. Just checker restaurant. fries. Restaurant. Checker, checker fries. fries are probably my favorites. Those are pretty good. Um, um, I like I like Wendy's fries, but that's just me. Taco Bell fries are pretty good, too. They're okay. But I, checkers I, is probably I think, my yeah, favorite. Checkers mm-hmm. is... I like the seasoning. Exactly. Checkers is the bomb. Yeah. And I like traditional McDonald's fries, too, if they're salty. Yeah. McDonald's fucks them up, though, so... Yeah. There's half the time you're, like, you're going to get really good fries, and then the other half, it's kind of like, uh, why the fuck did I even mm. get fries? I still eat them, though. Uh, no, Zax- Zaxby's fries are pretty good. They put some type of seasoning on Zaxby's fries. They're good, but I don't. Them. I, they're good, but I don't like. The, I don't like the style of fry. Yeah, I've never like had Zaxby's, so I wouldn't know. It's not that great. It's overpriced. In my it's opinion. Overpriced. In my opinion, it's overpriced. Oh. It's it's kind of the same as everything else. What's up? Chick Fil A waffle fries. Those are pretty good with the Polynesian sauce. I'm not a big fan of Chick Fil A's waffle bar- fries. I don't. I mean, I think I like the smaller, crispier ones. That's I think it. Chick-fil-A is probably the most overhyped, overrated restaurant. I do like the spicy. There. I do like the spicy chicken sandwiches. Whatever I like it is. Chicken. Yeah. Chicken's I think it's right. overpriced and over, uh, overhyped. I'm not a, really a fan of it. It is. Every. I mean, but they're trying to make it like a specialty. They they do accommodate and they have multiple lanes. Yeah, and they're it's both nice. backed up with 42 cars. But they're still doing but more than other them restaurants. Them 42 cars, them 42 cars will go through the line faster than 10 cars at McDonald's, yep. guaranteed. Or Taco Bell. Nope. Yep. Not when I go there. Chick Fil A, Chick Fil A's uh, business model is to have a car at the window every 34 seconds, and I believe it. Yeah, they're I think not they're the one in North decent. Lakeland. It stays busy as fuck, but they're it's they're on moving. the basic white they're pigeons. Moving. They're taking your order like bef- when you're by the freaking door yeah. at the restaurant. And then yeah, they're walking out yeah, with tablets. They're coming. They're delivering your food. So at least if you're still in line, a lot of times they'll bring your food while you're still in line. So you can sit there and eat your food if you want to while you're waiting to get out. Depending on the person, the nope, people in like front it. of you. I'd ra- that's better than not having your food at all. If someone has a big order in front of you and they're the asshole that orders fucking thirty chicken sandwiches and they're in the drive-through, and you have to sit there and wait for all that shit, at least. If you're trapped, they bring you your food. And like you when you go to McDonald's to and you buy like the 20-something double cheeseburgers like you've done in the past? <laughs> yes, it's just like us. When we're just like, fuck it. <laughs> yeah, we have a fast food party. Everybody got something different from a fast food restaurant. Yes, we're sometimes the assholes. But at least we're not like specialty orders. Like some people are like, are right, we going to need like 10 spicy chicken sandwiches? No, with no, with no, p- with no onions. Yeah. <laughs> I need 20 double cheeseburgers with no onions. <laughs> it's easier for them, though. Not necessarily. No, that's one less thing that they put on there. But if I was to say two with no onions, I need uh, extra cheese on this one. I need a, uh, and I mix it all up. We can do simple orders. That you can T7 just, that, steak that you can just bang out. Like with we the need, soft taco we need for twenty the fucking hard tacos, twenty soft tacos. Bam, you can do that real quick. Oh yeah, great. But we do so. <laughs> Uh, you guys uh, done the face app? Face app? I yep. saw Ross did it. Yeah. Ross looked old as fuck. Oh, uh, it's spot on too. I don't know if uh, I don't know if I saved mine. I don't think I did. I did. I did one, and I gotta say, I kind of look like uh, Brett Favre on the Copperfit commercial. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say you look like Bob. <laughs> Dude, I didn't look like my dad. I, I look like I don't know. The hair's the big, like the big thing. Different. 
Well, man, I didn't know I had a rooster going on, Ross. <laughs> Hold on. Let me fix the square deal on face at. <laughs> Hold on. Let me look at this. We probably did this can for I like... Send pictures? Huh? What if there's a way, what if there's a way I can send y'all media pictures through this app we're on? Uh, I don't know. Mm. Send a heart. Let me share see. a screen, maybe. Show you how old I fucking look. I look like 92 in my picture. Yeah, I look pretty good. <laughs> Born stupid, only 50, 50 <laughs> years later. That's great. <laughs> oh, let's see how far this goes before I, I don't want to knock anything over. I was like, born stupid, 50 years later. Oh, damn. <laughs> That's you just look, pretty it, accurate, it, right? You look like uh, Saddam Hussein. <laughs> <laughs> he does. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my it god, like it's so funny. Send that to me and then Micah send me one later. Hold on, let me do another one with this. You can actually see the mic in my face. Uh, oh, I say yeah. <laughs> I'll post them on our Facebook page. Alright. Let me redo yeah, it real like quick. That shit's so funny. Some sodomy insane. Sodomy insane. <laughs> Come sodomy on. Sodomy insane. Man. Come on. Don't do me like that. I don't want to send you the picture now. <laughs> sodomy insane. <laughs> <laughs> Ross got some beef with me and he's going to set me up. <laughs> I'll, fi I'll find like a good... Uh... But this motherfucker here. Oh, Mike just took a snapshot. Oh, look. I don't know how. You just sent me... Oh, yeah, it was what I did Are you earlier. taking a picture? Yeah. Oh, it was a snapshot. A <laughs> what? <laughs> I was trying to figure out if I could send y'all a picture of my, my old man face, but I can't. Text it to me later. Oh, I'll have to do it later. Just talking shit, you know what I mean? That was a bad picture for me. This is funny. Fucking old ass, fucking born stupid shit. Still doing it. I'm trying to get Ross's New England shit in the background. Damn right, there's no other way to do it. I'm trying to be courteous, so that way I get on his good side. I still got the Steeler shit on, though. Yeah, fuck that shit. Oh, born stupid shit. Meow. See that cat? Big Al. See, I might be able to do this. Hold on. Send a picture. It's a here. lot of dead air right here, too. It's, <laughs> 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 it's like, uh, we don't give a fuck right now. We're just trying to make sure we got these before we forget about them. <laughs> get these old man pictures. I should probably get a Bud Light, go. right? A Bush, Bush Light? light? Hey, how dare you say Bud Light on our airwaves? Come through. When it gets there, tell me I don't like Brett Favre still macking. <laughs> Driving your Mahindra tractor with your copper fits on. Hey, guys. My name is Brett Favre. Oh, speaking of copper fit, boss man had to get one for his elbow because he's got tendonitis. Mike is frozen. It at the race. You're frozen on the screen. I know because I'm trying to get back to it. I just sent y'all. I'm back. Am I back? <laughs> You're back. Yeah, right, we got you. <laughs> yeah, actually, you don't look all that old compared to me. Maybe it's the lighting. I just like have more gray. <laughs> I just sent you mine. <laughs> Boy, I look fucking rough. <laughs> you do it. <laughs> I don't look like you got hit by the Let me see if there's stick. a different old guy. I want to see if there's a there's a time travel too. There's one that says uh before now and then I think it's uh past or something like that. Thou shall not pass. Hey, there's Ross's going off Oh my god, Ross is like Santa Claus. <laughs> You're like fucking Tim Allen and Santa Claus. <laughs> is that a different one or they come just, out with different filters? I don't know, I just took that one. Oh. oh, man. This shit's funny. I think the one I was using is called Face App or something. Yeah. Yep. That's it. Yeah, that's that's the, the main one. But apparently, people are like, oh, yeah, you're giving all your information to Russia. This they already thing. got it. And the thing is, the uh, the terms that you accept are pretty much word for word for the same terms you give. Uh, you have to accept for Snapchat. Yeah, it's, so, they already got oh, all yeah. your fucking information. You got, you, got a, you got a smartphone. You got Facebook. You got all Instagrams and all that. Your shit's out there no matter what, so... Exactly. What are you guys doing September 20th? 
I don't know. Hopefully, I'll be home by then. You guys want to go to uh, Area 51? Oh, yeah? We can go ahead and barge the place? Yep, and get fucking annihilated by the U.S. Air Force. I was going to say, I really don't really care to go. No. <laughs> the, the, these people do know if they try to storm an Air Force base, they will be fucking gonna killed. They're going to die. Yeah. They're going to die. Fucking idiots. Uh John's still fucking around with his ass. How do I have a, I'm trying to send it to you? Just hit the little arrow down thing right oh. there. And it'll save it to your phone. There you go. See, that's why I think this whole fat face app thing was created because there was getting to be a big <laughs> party of Area 51 surgers. And now everybody's forgotten about it now that this face app comes out. So. Yep. Oh, damn. I think I... they do shit like that. Divert attention. Hold up. I sent it to the wrong thing. Hold up. How do I do that? Babe. Are you gonna let your? Right. I just got it, John. I didn't get it. I'm gonna send it to you, Micah. I'm sending it to both of you again. Jesus Christ! <laughs> 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 Piss Ross off. All right. You gonna well, let your kid ride in the top of the car and a. And a um, a pool. I don't see a problem with that as long as she doesn't hit a, uh, a street, right? Yeah, I said, uh, I guess apparently someone had the inflatable pool ratchet strapped to the top of the fucking strap. car. <laughs> John looks like a hairy butthole. <laughs> <laughs> it makes sense because you're... Uh, oh, oh man. Oh, man. What do you mean makes sense? Your, your face looks like fucking pubic hair. <laughs> oh, you're so funny. It kind of does. <laughs> it man, resembles my taint hair. <laughs> you're looking rough when you get older, man. Like, <laughs> well, um, Hopefully I keep you know my, my hopefully my hair's still like that long when I'm that old. Hopefully in like 30 or 40 years we still have these pictures and we can compare <laughs> ourselves to see how close this app actually was. Yeah, yeah, that would be pretty entertaining if we can that make it that far. Cool. Micah, your yeah. face is frozen. Uh, you're not I moving know, anymore. Frozen. So it's you're staring at something. Okay. No, huh? what, what happens is, is I'm sitting extremely still so maybe the cops are <laughs> 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 I thought you're doing a pretty damn good job. I don't see your lips moving at all. <laughs> I'm like a ventriloquist. I'm just talking <laughs> under my breath. I was like, you should probably, uh, you should probably go and try to practice that. You're not even blinking. <laughs> like a mannequin. What's up with this Moana birthday cake, John? All right, so yeah, I think this mom, or I think she ordered a birthday cake for her twenty-five do or twenty-fifth, her daughter's twenty-fifth birthday party, and her daughter likes Moana. When she ordered the cake. When they got it, it was a Little Pony marijuana cake. <laughs> <laughs> a Moana, some marijuana. <laughs> they thought it was funny, and they enjoyed it, and it was wow. not, not a big deal. But it was supposed to be Moana, not marijuana. <laughs> <laughs> it must have it was literally Publix. said marijuana, a Little Pony marijuana leaf on it. I'm Publix surprised would. they made that. Yeah, Publix wouldn't. I don't think Publix would. I'm sure would they would. No, I think Walmart might. Nah. I think Walmart would. Walmart might. The thing is, if you're going to make a marijuana cake, you might as well put marijuana in it. You might as well make it Fuck with that. marijuana. Why ruin a good cake? It's, I, 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 you'd cake. probably feel pretty good if you did. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sleeping. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. It, it, might, it might not put you to sleep. You There's things know? you should put it in, but not a birthday cake. Well, if kids are eating it, no, it should not be in it. <laughs> or if you, have, if you have to take drug tests or anything like that, you probably should stay away from it. Yeah. But... It's clearly a marijuana cake. So yep. if you want to consume it, you should assume <laughs> that there's marijuana in it. I think it's pretty funny. Do you guys see uh, Elon Musk? It, he already had something uh, planned or whatever, Neuralink. Basically, he's putting chip in your brain, and they have a compute like a robot basically weave in the chip and everything, and it's supposedly supposed to help your hearing. It's I, There's other things, but you can link your your brain to your accounts and, and they're worried like about your information being shared with the fucking face <laughs> app. and this dude wants to tap into your goddamn brain <laughs> yeah well he's adding to your brain so you're, yeah, you're yeah. supposedly you're gonna be able to he's collecting data you're supposed to be able to think faster you're supposed to hear better see better so you're upgrading you're my brain from an i5 processor to an <laughs> i7 you processor add memory, you add memory <laughs> to your brain what? like i think it's kind of crazy what's, 
What's going to happen is they're going to start holding you accountable for your thoughts. Yeah. Oh, like, man. Oh, man. That would yeah. be crazy. P- pass. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's like, just because, uh, oh, man, that would be a crazy idea. I, uh, well, it could because actually it, it could actually feel- help keep fucking bad people out there. I'm not uh, – I don't want that to happen. Like, I don't think this is crazy if they were monitoring what we're thinking and then or what we've done, and they're taking the data from what we've done to get, arrest you. Yeah. But I think I don't it, want that to happen because like there's times like a dog will be barking, but like, in my mind I'm thinking I'm gonna kill that dog. But I would yeah, never kill you that see, dog. you see and yourself just you putting jail. a noose around the dog's head, tying it around a tree, yanking that bitch like die. You're like I'm so tired of it barking. <laughs> <laughs> Ross recording something. Frozen Micah. <laughs> yeah, frozen Micah. Micah's talking about killing you dogs. Want to let us know, man. No, no. <laughs> Come on, man. Y'all gonna use that against me in court? Like, <laughs> that, the, the whole point was we're not. You're not gonna do it. Sometimes you like no. even your own dog. You're like, shut the fuck up. I'm so tired of you barking, that's, and I want to kill you. But you're not gonna kill saying, your dog. Like, kill them all. Just got a snap from Ross. A lot of times I don't say it though. You might think it though. Like God, I just fucking yeah, I'm tired of this. Fucking you might think it, but I'm not gonna kill my. There's dog. a lot of things that you think. Yeah, there's a lot of things that you think, but you never act on. Like, dude, you have bad days of work. You're like, I'm going to fucking quit today. You just wait till the boss man gets here. I'm going to fucking tell him. Then he I gets need to pay here. my mortgage. Hey, never mind. Day, <laughs> <laughs> no. It, 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 is, uh, it is like that sometimes. I think you like, wouldn't kill your dogs, John. I would not. Your dogs are dumb. My dogs are a pain in the <laughs> ass. I have never had dogs that have pissed me off more than the dogs I have right now. <laughs> And it, it's all because Jenny is a tard and Forrest grew up He's thinking a tard that's, too. that's how it is. That's the right way to act. And I'm going to be a tard too. I've tried, <laughs> I've tried to correct him and I'm like, God, you're so annoying. Like, you just don't fucking listen. I'm like, tried training him. I tried doing tre- – like, dude, they're just dumb. Just leave the pool gate open one day. <laughs> <laughs> I've thought that. <laughs> See, Elon Musk knew that and he told me. <laughs> I've thought that and I'm like, God, nope, we're not gonna, I'm not going to do it. But that'd be an it easy way to solve it. They, they would they probably drown. They're dumb as fuck. Yeah. And it's not the fact that they, they're not capable of getting out. They're just, they'd probably just they're sit there and swim. They'd smart. swim <laughs> until they got tired enough or they just didn't swim anymore. I'm like, oh, my God. Yes, they are annoying as fuck. But I would not kill them. <laughs> but yeah, that's pretty crazy, though. Yep. And if you're going to do that, like, then why are you taking exams and stuff to get into school? Everybody should be on equal playing field, right, if everybody had the chips? Equal play, equal pay. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't know. I, don't, I don't know if that's a good idea. I'm going to let other people try it out first before I do anything. I'll jump. I'll be the first guy to do it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, thanks. You won't even get the – they'll fucking kill you trying to put the chip in your brain. One slip of the wrist. Damn. Oh, damn it. He's dead. <laughs> slip of the wrist. <laughs> Just one a slip, slip of the wrist. <laughs> Just do a remix. Yep. Oh, man. That'd be terrible. Uh, if you have, uh, you have like, doctor fuck-ups, and you have the video, oh. like, different clips, <laughs> different clips of doctors fucking up, and it's just a slip of the wrist. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That'd be an That's interesting video. Plastic surgery. Oh, yeah. We hear about him off, cutting off the wrong person's arm or the wrong person's leg. Because the wrong folder has been in their, uh, in the yeah. little folder holder the, in the room. They took the good one off, and then they had uh, both arms missing. Or no, or that, or there was double people, in, like double occupied rooms, and rather than the guy on the left, his arm was supposed to be amputated. They took the guy on the left, on the right, his arm oh. off instead. Oh yeah, I've heard of that shit. Yeah. Oh, that pissed me off so bad. Yep, this has no problem at all, and they just removed it like you bitch. They will you in, they see the other guy in there, like, oh, shit, we think we did the wrong guy. Oh, man. Oh, oh somebody was uh, telling me about something happened over there. Oh, it was a guy at work. He was telling me about his daughter whenever they went in, and she had she always has ear infections, and they put fluid in her ears or whatever and to clear it or clean them or whatever, and it's supposed to drain properly, and they put so much in, they're expecting so much out. What swelled up in her eye, and they end up having to slit the corner of her eye to release the fluid. And I'm like, that is crazy. And it's your kid too. It's like I would be freaking the fuck mm-hmm. out because they can't get, they couldn't get it out back out of her ear. And it's supposed oh. to be, dra- it's supposed to properly drain, and it's it just wasn't. Just some Q-tips in there. Man, they had they cut. Oh, I was like, they cut the corner of the eye. I'm like, oh, the eye socket or whatever that is, just to release fluid. Mm-hmm. I'm like, ah, oh, I don't know if I can do that. 
like that's, I guess that's I, very, I, yeah. you could if you had to, but it's just a scary experience. I could only like I couldn't imagine that. You can only imagine. I can't. I can't think about it. Only imagine. So what y'all got going on this week? Mm. Work, more work. Work. Jiu -jitsu, I got a lot of work. Weightlifting. <laughs> training. <laughs> y'all racing this week, Micah? Yeah, racing Friday night and Saturday night. Two different cars. And we've had blown motors that we were changing last week. And blew a tire out on the motorhome that we used to take the trailer. So we've had all kinds of shit blowed here lately. Chop another bolt down the carburetor? No, yep, we didn't do that. <laughs> that was somebody else I was talking. Ross has blown a motor. <laughs> He's going to be busy for a long time. Oh, I, call, I call that whenever I eat Taco Bell. About an hour later, I just got done blowing a motor. <laughs> 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 well, that sucks. That, right. Yeah. Then again, to give you a little it's bit been, of a break. Yeah, it's been a it's been a rough summer. Like I thought it was actually gonna get easier because now I got a coworker. And you weren't gonna be and, there. Yep, and it's been <laughs> the complete opposite of what I thought was gonna be happening. Like we've had so much odd, dumb shit happen this year that double the people, double like, the work. Yeah, well, I was gonna say, and, but and were, thank God you have an ex person now. Just think about yeah, it. If you're up there without that person, we, and it would have been like last year, you've been fucked. Oh, I'm still. It's, we've worked more hours this year than we have the last two years, and I don't know how I got it done the last two years. So, yeah, yeah. it's crazy, man. Hey, it just never slows down. Yesterday was the first day since I've been here that I actually got off on time at the end of a regular eight-hour day. Yeah, that's gonna come and bite you in the ass next week. <laughs> that's that's fine. That's whatever. Like I said, like like it, it's so bad that it. Like, my hands and my arms hurt, like, every day when I go home. Like, it's worse than going to the gym. <laughs> well, I'm sorry it's been going bad for you, man. I would – can I try to cheer you up? No jokes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. I need a joke. All right. Do you know the difference between a toad and a horny toad? Um, One's a horny toad and one's a toad? No, a toad says ribbit, ribbit. A horny toad says, rub it, rub it. Yes! Yes, it worked! No, I was laughing because <laughs> Mike could laugh without even moving his face. That's amazing. <laughs> hey, hey, let's play a game to see who can keep the, the straightest face the longest. Micah wins. Micah hasn't blinked like in 35 minutes. That's amazing. <laughs> All right, whoever loses has to drink some beer. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, I heard that at work this week. It was pretty That's good. Pretty good. There was another one I heard, but I don't remember. That was just an easy one. <laughs> <laughs> They're normally pretty easy. I just don't remember them. I'm terrible with jokes. Oh shit! My Amazon package is about to pull up. Uh oh! What'd you order? Oh, a pop vinyl, Funko Pop vinyl. A what? One of those things. A what? A Funko Pop. Oh. Pop vinyl. Funko. Yep. Like little mini miniature. Uh. Animated versions of like TV character shows, like the Game oh, of Thrones people yeah. have there, the Stranger Things guys I have there. Oh, like okay. the one chick, she's Egos. holding a box of Egos. <laughs> yeah. What's Egos? Egos waffles. Oh. <laughs> Lego my Egos. Yeah. It's been a while since I had breakfast. Yeah. Fucking pop. I don't. Mean, what are they called again? Pop vinyls. Where that Patriot flag is going to be. Um, I'm, I'm probably going to buy the lumber today. I'm going to make a big giant uh wooden shelf to put a bunch of those on. That's already there, though. Yeah, it's not going to be there when I'm done. <laughs> but you said where it's going to be. Yeah, it's going to be there where the Patriot flag is. Pretty much that same that same size. Pretty cool. What? Where are you going to do with the Patriot flag? Uh, I don't know. Uh-oh, Mike put us on hold. Uh-oh. That motherfucker. Dude, if if it's good content, My leave God. it going. You get pulled over? <laughs> no. Somebody tried to call and interrupt the thing. Oh, well, we don't see your frozen face anymore. We just see MW. 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 Mm. It's kind of like the, uh, that's going to be my symbol, so if I ever make it as a country music star, that's what's, what's going to be popping up on the screen as they're doing the intros. A white circle with a blue MW in the middle? That's blue, that's right? That's right. We're going, yeah, it's we're going basic. <laughs> it's my basic, blue, right? Since I'm a basic white bitch, my symbol might as well be too. I don't want to put on the interwebs and I'm colorblind. <laughs> oh, basic ass. 
Uh, should, we, should we wrap this thing up? How long has it been? An hour and uh, ten minutes. That's not that long. Yeah. yeah. It has it's longer than our bit. podcast the last two weeks. Yeah. We had <laughs> I've been getting text messages. <laughs> For what? Uh, text messages and voicemails from uh, our no podcast. Oh, like what's going on? on? Yeah, the first one was, hey, uh, you may want to check iTunes. I don't see a podcast since uh, June 30th. Oh. I'm like, yeah, we've, we've been on a... On a break. Oh, no, that motherfucker's driving by my house. Oh, got his hopes up. <laughs> Too well, fast. It, it's supposed to be delivered today. Oh. But, uh, and then he actually left a voicemail Thursday. Like, dude, what's up? I, I don't, I deleted it. Like, are y'all, are y'all having hey, a man, falling I'm out? I'm just wondering what the hell's going on with this Barn Stupid show. He was doing a fake accent. Yeah. That's funny. I put LOL. We'll be back, uh, we'll be back this weekend. Yeah. Well, that's good that people care. I'm trying to c- curious what's going on. It's what is our views like? Do you know? Have you seen anything? We've had none. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm saying like uh, from our current, like what we, content we already have. Like 1,600 clicks. That's not bad. Well, I just, right? I don't know if that's per click or if you start it and then come back an hour later or start it. Yeah, that's okay. We get about 17 clicks per episode. It's not too bad. Yeah. It's not terrible. Could be better. <laughs> We appreciate. Not terrible. We put, appreciate yeah, the clicks. I don't know how many of those are us. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like four. Yeah, I'm like every time I load it, it's a click. So I'm four or five alone. I love the clicks. I mean, clicks. It's all about I mean, the clicks. It's all the clips. Clicks. Oh man. I'll think about clicks now. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta let Mike get out of here before the cops pull him over. Yeah, and I gotta pee too. I gotta piss so bad. Well, sorry for the delay. We appreciate you listening. Yep. You know, can't wait to have Micah back in person so yep. we don't have this delay and awkward back and forth that we have, miscommunication. Yep. It's all my fault. <laughs> it's <laughs> all your fucking fault, Micah. It really is. It really scheduling, is the scheduling's fucking Micah's yeah. fault. John being late's Micah's fault. Yeah. <laughs> fucking <laughs> fuck you, Micah. All right, well, we'll see y'all. See y'all next week. Later.